today, Precarious Plays Fire Emblem. Should I bring the lords around back? Yeah, because it's going to be easier than taking them up the front again. They have Ninian with them. Back relative to where? Uh, uh, back this way. You need to go that direction anyway to get the body ring. Right. That's the whole reason why I'm interested in going down there. <sighs> Alright, you two lovebirds are going to have to be separated for it. Not very long because we have Ninian and she's awesome. Nope. Oh. <laughs> I hate this place. I hate it. Everything is itchy. You know what I just realized? What? That. Oh, I, I wonder if they've been getting friendship experience. I, I wonder if this is a situation where, like, too much proximity is a detriment to the relationship. I would think so. Like, maybe if they're sitting on the horse, they just sit there really awkwardly blushing near one another without actually growing any closer. <laughs> oh, more <laughs> appeared on the scene. All of this physical... Pro Not. No. No. All of this physical proximity is so stifling. <laughs> Yeah, that'll. I swear she's gonna. Yep, yep! I knew it. Yes! <laughs> she. I can't she believe got we crud. lost, brother. Ah, it's a tragedy, Jasmine. Oh boy. Boom. And I, was that nineteen? Is she now? She's now like twenty points away from twenty. Yeah. Sweet. That was a sweet level up good, too. Good. 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 Okay. Lucius better be shooting Rebecca a serious sting guy after that. Yeah. That was some straight up kill stealing. That was not cool, Rebecca. <laughs> Have I told you about Rebecca? What, sorry, not sorry. What that name has has be that was a very Rebecca move in my mind. Yeah. Um. As you play the video games mm -hmm. that I play anyway. Got a body ring. That's very important. Um. We'll have to think think hard. We'll have to make a weapon-dependent decision, I would say, on that. Okay. On who gets that ring. Um, but as I have played video games over the years, I play a lot of games that require a lot of names. Yes. Just Mass Effect, as an example. By the time I was on, like, my, you know, fourth or fifth Mass Effect character... Mm-hmm. I needed to have a lot of names for for the purposes of, uh, of identifying separate characters, right? Right. So, one thing that I do to ease that burden on myself, mm -hmm. ease the burden of trying to come up with all of these names, especially for games that feature like guild-like mechanics, yeah. Stuff like uh, Disgaea, where you wind up with dozens of units sometimes. Yeah. Um, or XCOM, for example. Anything where you have a large number of units, generic units, that you have to provide names for, or it can provide names for, and you may want to to make them easier to remember. I wind up drawing a lot of names from Fire Emblem. Well, they're nice names, and they all also have kind of like a character and a class attached to them. Yes, but occasionally that winds up going... going awry. Yeah. Because what has happened is I was using the name Rebecca for a... Sentinel in Mass Effect? Uh-huh. Which made some sense. I think that... I picked the class, and then I was like, well, she's sort of ranged. Who do I know that's that's ranged? That's generally just about staying away from direct combat and being cool. And then I thought, well, what about Rebecca from Fire Emblem? And as it happened, whenever I got to, like, the first moral decision I needed to make, mm -hmm. I slammed that renegade option. <laughs> just because I had already been a paragon several times. And I thought, well, that's, that's how this is, uh... That's how this is turning out. I have Rebecca, the Sentinel, who is now a renegade. Yes. Um, if you don't move him within, uh, within range of that Axeman, but if you move near those bones, you'll get another prize. A prize, a prize. Yes. Um, That's safe, right? Should be. Ugh. 
desert. Hate it. Nasty. Desert nasty. It sounds like that should, I don't know, be on a shirt or something. Desert nasty? Yeah, desert nasty. I am sure that it is hmm. somewhere. Somewhere. Anyway, Rebecca, for me, has grown into the name that I use whenever I'm going to have, like, a generalist. Yeah. Or uh, a, a, a character that's generally good at things, but has a, a, a ranged bent. Right? Right. And is also on the nasty end of things. <laughs> so Rebecca is, like, a rebel... In your own personal headcanon? Yes. Rebecca, for me, it has come to signify a character that will be pretty good at everything, usually shoot people sneakily from far away, <laughs> which is perfect here, and is a little snarky or or uh, is rene renegade flavored. I have a question. Yes. Do you think that it would be better to bring Priscilla around this way so she gets to that second boss faster and she can just use the massive staff if we need to? Or do you think that she has any chance of catching up with the group on foot? There is no there is no path for her on the right side. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. If she moves further to the right, then she'll just have to... Go down and in. Yeah, and that's just more desert down there. There's no way. Okay. This is like the one area where Priscilla is at a disadvantage over someone like Sarah. Mm. All right, we're good over here. Yep. Her horse is an enormous detriment in the desert. There we go. Because we spent so much time being afraid of the boss, I was like, what is she doing? I hope she knows what she's doing. I hope she checked all of the numbers. <laughs> and then I remember that it's Raven versus a normal axe dude. Yes. <laughs> All right, have um, Legault move just under those bones. And that should be one of the items. I think it's uh, an item for Ninian. And then I'm gonna check the map, actually. I'm yeah, gonna bring up the map. already there. Above the bones, You'll get an eclipse tome. I can do that. Yeah, right, we'll be able to snag that. Let's go. That. Because this guy doesn't have a killer weapon, who are you going to have fight him? Because it could it could be a lot of different people. I'm not really sure. I would like uh, either Dart or Raven to do it because Dart is 17 and Raven is 17. And their partners are outstripping them right now. I don't know when it happened. I remembered Rebecca being sort of behind everyone. Mm -mm. But she has caught up with Today. a vengeance. Yeah. <laughs> She's probably going to be like the second person we have that changes class now. I think that if we advance... And I think we have an Orion's Bolt, so I think she can do it straight away. Oh, God. Can you... Help me for a second. What do you need? I just need you to keep an eye on the shifting sands for me. Hold on. Let me see it. Go ahead and just move Dart down one and right one, and then base all of your future movements off of him. Okay. Now, as, as long as you're moving diagonally... And he would be diagonally to yes, him. Yes, right. And then... And everyone else can do the same. Strictly speaking, I'm pretty sure Lucius is going to have the easiest time actually killing that guy. Yeah. Hold on, have her move down one. Because if she moves down one, she'll be uh, sort of in range for the psychic staff. Yeah. And because she can only move one square at a time. Nee, nee, nee. Why the hell doesn't Ninian count? As one of the robed people? Who knows? Sand in her shoe. This yeah. happening. I'm gonna suggest that it's because she's just she's such a cool lady and she's out of her element here. <laughs> Go ahead and have Legault move above the uh 
Oh. I'm okay, just well. Let me go around back. Yeah. It's okay. We'll get there. <sighs> Why are you moving the lords if you're not going to use them to kill the boss? Because I want them to be there for the ceremony. That is taking so much longer. I can't believe you. Why have I, It's this desert heat. It's just oh my God, it's driving no one, me batty. No one can get close enough. We're going to have to pull the boss and somebody's going to have to take a hit. No, that's not true. Lucius can do it. Lucius can get there. Oh my God, you're right. Just see what kind of damage he can do. Don't actually do it yet. 10. What about um Shine? Twelve. Dude, this is the person that killed him before. Yeah. This is terrible. I think that... But let's crunch numbers on Raven. How... What kind of... Um... I have these back here. No. What? That's a huge waste because <laughs> bosses have already changed class, so they're almost always worth 100 experience. What is the... What's the attack power of the boss? Uh... 28, that's a lot. It is. But he has a really low crit, which is the thing that I was worried about. 28, and then... That's 20, that's 20 damage. What? But speed 20 versus speed 14. Here, take this back. What if Hawkeye comes into the I nab the, the controller to pick all of that up. What? Oh god, Hawkeye's never gonna fucking make it there. No, he can get there. That's pretty good. That's acceptable movement. But you, why would you do that? We're not gonna use Hawkeye. No, to let him take the first blow and pull him... No, because his crit rate is so low, this is what you should do. Check that guy's movement one last time. Whenever it's time to fight him, mm -hmm. Raven will be the one because he can definitely tank the first one. Okay. The important thing is that you just need to get Priscilla closer so that way she can psychic him. Okay. Even if he has to move. So one to the left. And we need to wait. Um, I, I completely forgot. The only person that's going to be able to use Eclipse is um, Athos. Yeah. So let's just forget about that and go after the the light brand. Okay. So where's the light brand? To ah. the right of the bones, up there. So up after, here? yeah, to the right of the bones. Those four squares. Okay. We'll get the light brand and then we'll just fight the boss and win. Okay. Um, everybody, yeah. And. End. Exciting. Riveting. Wait. With Ninian's help, you may be able to get there this turn. Definitely. There, right? Yes. Ooh, this... All of this counting is becoming very intense. No! Wait. <laughs> uh, that was scary. I'm going to start being able to do that to actually joke with you. And uh -huh. you I'm going to make you poop your pants. Go ahead and get that sweet light brand. Now one of our sword users has a ranged attack. There. Yay. It's probably going to go to... Shoot, who needs it? Oh, we don't, we're not using Guy or Matthew, so I guess no one really needs it. I would hmm. be happy to give it to one of the lords. Uh, Ellie Wood gets spears once he changes class, and Lynn's get, Lynn gets bows, so they don't need it. Okay. Similarly, Raven, he gets axes. Here's my problem right now. Yeah. Raven can't get to him this turn. He's not. He's going to... He's going to... Pull him. Pull him, yeah. Okay. So probably put his iron sword on, just in case, I think. That's probably the safe bet. Does that guy have a, a hand axe? Or a ranged weapon? Does he have a bow? That sucks. Go ahead and... B and then check his movement one actual more time. Yeah, no, this is actually this is acceptable because this means that he'll have to move forward if I just move one square. And he'll put on his shittier hand axe. True. Okay, here we go. Yeah, so have him move there. Okay. And put the iron sword on. Okay, he already has it on. Um, he's already at full health. 
he's close mean, enough. Yeah. That that's fine. If we lose by one hit point, then I just don't want to play anymore. Have make sure that he's not in range of the and have Lucius move down one. Yes. Okay. And just so that way Rebecca is a little closer, I think she should. No, she's fine where she is. Priscilla needs to move closer. Sorry, that's that's what I meant. <sighs> okay. Why are horses so bad at moving in the desert, but camels... Horses aren't actually bad at moving in the desert, are they? They're not great, but camels are better because their feet are soft and big and flappy. So they are, but camels are better. Okay. Yes. Good? Yes. Now let's see if the game gives Don't us a die. bullshit range crit. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Wow, outburst of nervous laughter. <laughs> okay. Check everyone's numbers. My hand is actually sweating a little bit. <laughs> Mine is too. So he might do 19 and get not dead. Unless I hate that 1% crit chance. I don't like it. Well, let's just... It's not allowed. What can Rebecca do? Well, that's with the, the, iron, oh, uh, the yeah, long yeah. bow. Check the, the sh steel bow first. 14. So she could hit him if three people hit him. Oh, check the the short bow and see what her crit rate, uh, uh, her crit chance is like with the short bow. Let's see if it gets up to 40. No, it's no. only 20. That's weird. Mm -hmm. Did I... But she would do 20 damage. Oh, she hits case. twice. Yeah, she okay, hits no, that's, twice. That's way better. She still is pretty good. Even if she crits once, that would be 30 plus 10. I doubt that even with the Fire Emblem trying to make a liar of me, I doubt that she would crit twice, which is what she would have to do to kill him. Mm -hmm. I would actually lead with that. Okay. And we're stuck in the situation, so you should probably do it. Okay. Okay. It's a bit of a shame she didn't get to 20. Yes. I would not bother using Dart right now. I would use... I would check to see if Raven can just kill him out right now. Yes. Which he can. Yes. He... Hold on, though. Who of Lucius and Raven... It's Raven that needs it's the Raven. experience. It's Raven, yeah. Raven and Dart are need, the, need it the most. Okay, last thing. Yep. Can... Legault either move just above the bones down there or to the far left side of the bones that he's already adjacent to, or nearly adjacent to, I should say. Have him move down to Ninian, and let's just get the Eclipse Tome so we have another treasure. Okay. <laughs> Treasures. Ninian does... Dance. dance. Woo. <laughs> Nothing left to do. <laughs> okay, and where's he going? Over here? No, above the bones. To the right. Ah. Go all the way. Oh, no. Here. There. Yes. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. There it is. There we go. Eclipse, I think, is a pretty alright tome. I can't remember why, though. Okay. Nothing left but me. The maybe it deals like 50% damage. Or, like right. always. Maybe it's percentage based damage. Finish him. Wait. One more thing. Check to see if. Ellie Wood and Lynn. Let's see if I can do this twice in one session. Check to see if they're friends yet. No. Okay, not yet. Okay, so just have Raven do his his murderings. Yes. Eh. Fine. I got hit, but it feels good. These people are too strong, Paul. Paul's dead, friend. Sorry about that. Well, there we go. We don't have to worry about Raven for a little while. Oh, Raven. Maybe we have to worry about Raven for a little while. <laughs> Slouching on the job. <clears throat> you really helped me out. Thank you. We couldn't watch such a lopsided battle. That's. <laughs> yeah, it's lopsided, but I'm not sure if it was lopsided in the in the way that Ellie would may have been suggesting there. <laughs> so why have you come to this wasteland? Well. We were told to come here and meet a living legend. Living legend? Ha ha ha. I see. That's well said. 
But do you know what it means? Yes, I suppose I do. Looks like we share a common destination. Hawkeye, you're here too. Pent, did you find it? That I did. And as I thought, it's spectacular. It's getting dark. Let's go back. Yes, let's make haste. Desert knights are treacherous. Oh, uh, okay. Except side quest? Oh, yes, except side quest. We did it, bro! <clears throat> I don't mind going with you, but how far do we have to walk? No matter how far we go, there's just more sand. Amen. Whoa. Hector? Whoa! I think that might have been an actual whoa. What is it? Heck. Yeah! Hector? Lindis? Oh my god, you lemmings. <laughs> <laughs> you called them lemmings? Where did those two. Huh? What in blazes? I'm. I'm sinking into the sand. Well, he must be very oh, well spoken boy. to get out that much. Okay. I feel like my performances yes, there right. were a little weak, but that was a really silly scenario, so.